Hello, this is Mathematics, and Flying XO asks, How come when you multiply two negative numbers, you get a positive number? This is a great question. Maybe you were taught this in your pre-algebra class, but you were just told to do so without a real explanation. Well, this video is going to explain why. Okay, let's get started. First, in order to understand what's going on when multiplying two negative numbers, I think it's important to see what's going on when multiplying two positive numbers. Let's use a really simple example, like 3 times 2. Obviously, the answer is 6. But the reason I'm using this example is to show what it looks like visually on a number line. Okay, one way to consider multiplication is repeated addition. So 3 times 2 is the same as two groups of three, or the same as three groups of two. Regardless, the answer is positive and on the right side of the number line. Now, let's look at a similar example. Negative three times two on a number line. Clearly, the answer is negative 6. And when using repeated addition on the number line, negative 3 times 2 is the same as two groups of negative 3. So, negative 3 plus negative 3 equals negative 6. Notice how the answer is negative and is on the left side of the number line. Maybe you can see where I'm going with this. When we had two positive numbers, the answer was on the right side, but when adding a negative, the answer was on the left side. It seems obvious, but it's clear that the negative causes the number to switch sides. So what happens when we add another negative number? Using the number line again, let's look at negative 3 times negative 2. Notice how the only difference between this example and the previous one is an extra negative. So, if a negative sign causes a number to switch sides on a number line, this extra negative should cause the answer to switch from the left side to the right side. In other words, when the answer goes back to the right, we can see that it is positive. This is why a negative times a negative equals a positive. Anyways, I hope this video explains what's going on when multiplying two negative numbers. Please do be sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and if you want me to keep making more content like this. And also, if you have any math questions, please do feel free to comment, and I will make a video on it. Anyways, thanks for watching. Bye.